living organisms are equipped with special organs called sense organs that enable them to receive information about the surrounding environment. Sense organs only receive information and transmits the same in the form of electric currents to the brain. Each sense organ is made up of several hundreds of cells, but only some of them receive the sensory information. These cells are called receptor cells or receptors. Several receptor cells together form a sense organ. One of the important properties of the sense organ is that it responds to a stimulus of particular intensity. There are five major sense organs in the human body. Eyes, ears, nose, tongue, and skin. Both smell and taste depend on the chemical nature of the substance and its solubility in water. We can neither smell nor taste substances which are not soluble in water. The receptors sensitive to taste and smell are called chemoreceptors. Receptors for smell and taste are physically separated in air-breathing land vertebrates. Human nose has a long narrow cavity which is divided into upper nasal cavity and the lower vestibular cavities. The nasal cavity is lined with mucous membrane which is supplied with numerous blood vessels. The mucous membrane secrete mucus to keep the membrane moist. The membrane also has olfactory receptors. When the air enters the nose, chemicals with smell present in the air dissolve in the moisture present on the mucous membrane. These chemicals are detected by the olfactory receptors. From the base of each of the receptor cells, a nerve fiber is given off and the nerve fibers from different cells pass through the holes present on a plate. This plate separates the nasal cavity from the rest of the skull. Later, all these nerve fibers join to form the olfactory nerve. When the presence of a chemical substance is detected, a small electrical current is given by the receptor cell which travels down the nerve fiber and is carried to the brain by olfactory nerve. The information about the sense of smell is analyzed by a separate center in the brain. In vertebrates, except in fishes, the taste receptors are located on the tongue. In fishes and in vertebrates, the tongue is absent. The receptors are scattered across their body. Taste and smell are related. For example, during cold, we feel the food is tasteless when we cannot smell it. The taste receptors are present in the taste buds, which are distributed all over the tongue. Each taste bud has a cavity with a pore called taste pore. Each receptor cell has a free hair like cilium which protrude into the cavity. In addition to sight, smell, hearing, taste, and touch, humans have the awareness of balance, pressure, temperature, pain, and motion, all of which may require the coordinated use of multiple sensory organs. The tongue has four kinds of receptor cells, sour, bitter, salt, 
and sweet. Generally, the taste buds close to the tip of the tongue are sensitive to sweet taste, whereas those at the back of the tongue are sensitive to bitter taste. The taste buds on the top and on the side of the tongue are sensitive to salty and sour tastes. The hot taste of chilies is not a taste, but a physical sensation which irritates the tongue. Tongue also has receptors to sense the temperature. Women in general have a greater number of taste buds than men. When food enters the mouth, the chemical substances that give taste to the food dissolve in the saliva. Through the taste pore, this saliva enters the cavity in the taste bud and bathes the taste receptors. A small electrical potential is generated when the receptor cells come in contact with the chemicals dissolved in saliva. This information is carried to the brain by the nerve fibers given off by the receptor cells. There are five major sense organs in the human body. Eyes, ears, nose, tongue and skin. The sense organs only receive information and transmits the same in the form of electric currents to the brain. The receptors which detect smell and taste are called chemoreceptors. Both smell and taste depend on the chemical nature of the substance and its solubility in water. Olfactory receptors are present on the mucous membrane of the nasal cavity. The smell of the chemicals dissolved in the mucus is detected by the olfactory receptors. The taste receptors are present in the taste buds, which are present all over the tongue. The presence of taste-giving chemical substances is detected by the taste receptors. There are separate taste receptors for sweet, sour, salt and bitter tastes.